Hello, hello everybody, this is Cameron from Critical Hit Gaming. Um, I'm sure you all know me by now. I mean, I don't need to introduce myself. <laughs> Alright, um, so I did listen to my video yesterday, and if you did watch it, you'll notice that my sound was pretty terrible. And, uh, well, first, let, let me just, uh, random a character. I don't care what we do, it depends on who we get, I suppose. Uh, Samson, we need to go for the boss rush mode, basically, so I'm gonna go for that. Um... My sound was pretty terrible. I didn't know when I was making it that the game would be so overpowering. But as you can hear today, it's a little bit better. Hopefully there's no background noise that really uh, gets in there. But uh, the mic is still... I'm still using the normal PlayStation 4 mic. Um, if you've listened to any of... watched any of other videos, you know that we normally sound better because of higher quality. And uh, me and Brad do have a really nice mic. I mean, not crazy nice, but you know, much better than this free one that you get. And, uh, but I didn't get a chance to pick it up tonight, so I'm hoping that, uh, tomorrow I will, uh, be able to use that, and I'll be able to sound much better on these runs. That way you guys will be able to tell how sexy my voice really is, you guys will be able to, uh, you know, actually hear me, and hear my commentary and what I think, which I'm assuming is what you come for, if you come at all, and, you know, I come twice a day, it's a rule that my father told me to live by. Oh, ho. Zing. Alright, well, Wrath was pretty easy. Uh, always is, always will be. I mean, even like Super Mega Wrath or whatever they call them, Mega Wrath. I've been playing Pokemon, so I'm, you know, I'm sorry if I got Omega stuck in my head right now. Why can't I hit that? Oh man, I'm gonna take the, some of the worst damage ever. I, I swear to God, these guys are my kryptonite. You can just call me Superman. I don't even know if that's a song. I feel like it is, though. Alright, I'm not a fan of these big rooms, especially ones with uh, spiders or enemies of any kind. And I've just taken three hits. Almost four hits there. This is one of my more embarrassing runs. Uh, I should pay more attention. I do have Trail of Tears. These guys should be literally cake. If I Because they're spiders, they chase me, I've got creep. That guy should be easy, he's a champion. I'm not sure, I don't think I'm playing on hard mode, but it's kind of, I feel like it's kind of weird to run into a champion on the first floor. But it's probably not that weird. I just don't feel like it happens to me a lot. But the last run that you guys watched that I was in that you couldn't hear me, I mean, I did really well. Don't know why. Uh, it just, the game was handing me a victory. It wanted me to, it wanted me to be a liar when I said I'm not good at this game. Which I'm sure it was obvious. I forgot a lot of things. I, I didn't do well just because I guess I, uh, did well. You know, the game made me do well. It wasn't my own personal skill. Oh, the only thing I've got is sometimes I make good decisions. Uh, usually I do not, though. Duke of Flies is usually nothing to be too scary about. Um, I would probably use a bomb, but I don't know for sure if I would actually make it through the flies. And I only have two. These are big ass flies. I think I am going to use a bomb, just give it a go. Oh, see those fucking flies? So freaking. No, those fucking flies stop them all the time. There you go, you son of a bitch. I right, took all my bombs, but I just didn't want to... I got places to go, alright. Oh, man, that's... Uh, that's basically the most ideal item I can get, going for a boss rush mode, being able to run really fast and uh, be a little bit smaller. It's really going to help me out here, and that is a bit of sarcasm there. I hope it did shine through. It, although, you know, it may not have sounded that way, because speed upgrades... I, I don't think speed upgrades are terrible, but I really need some damage upgrades, especially if I want to get to Mom's heart fast. Not mom's heart, uh, mom's fast. I, like, if I get a boss rush mode, I don't care if we actually get any further. But I just, like, I want to get one more thing on the notepad done if I could on this character. Because boss rush mode is one of my hardest, like, I, I think it's easier to beat the lamb than it is to get the boss rush mode, just because I'm slow at these games. I'll take that pill. Tears up? Man, I should have taken that forever ago. Oh, I wish I was Isaac. I'd purposely die to those for no reason. Yeah, I would have to go through a whole a whole lot of stuff. I don't even know the whole process. I'll probably never unlock a uh, he who should not be named character because it sounds like hell. And uh, don't get me wrong, I have nothing against hell. I haven't been there myself. I can't say if it's good or bad. But if I'm to believe what people tell me, it's not the you know it's not all that great. Did I skip a room? I must have a, a curse of the blankety blank or something. I mean, I, I'm sure it's not actually called Blankety Blank, it's like, blah, 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 maze, yeah. Still, it's kind of funny that it just made me skip an entire room. It's not a bad thing. I mean, at least not on these floors. 
Oh, and a key right outside my uh, item room. Awesome. Ooh, and a uh, Bob's Curse. Yeah, five bombs. They are poison. I... Oh, man. Oh, wait, never mind. I, I'm just fuck, freaking insane. Well, that one that one did, did screw with me. I am going to use a bomb or two on the boss, most likely. I can't picture a boss that I won't use a bomb on. Oh, my gosh. I, and I took red heart damage on this floor, and I haven't found anything. I'm... Just, Point is, this is this is why it's called Let's Lose That Divine and Advise It, because I'm doing... I'm not feeling good about this run so far. I've got Caffeine Pill, and I mean, Poison Bombs are strong. I mean, I'm not like dead in, you know, dead in the water or anything by any means. I just... You could have a much stronger start than this one. You could also have a much weaker start. Like, you could be... I could have gotten a Tears Down Pill, and I could have gotten Poop and Yum Heart at the same time. Like, oh, that's awesome. Yeah, take that. Okay, why... Well, Get him. I don't know what happened. I wasn't paying attention. This is how bad I am. Pin, I actually was hope was I pin super easy, and he's <laughs> he's probably the boss I should try it and I should not use any bombs against because he is very easy. He's probably the easiest boss, but he's to me he's also one of the hardest bosses to hit with bombs. So yeah, when I said I couldn't vision, I didn't think I'd fight Pin. Oh, that's actually a. Now that it has a damage up, it is pretty substantial. I believe, was it only shot speed before? Which, I still like shot speed. Like, all the stats have their own, you know, strengths that are, like, are important. It makes hitting things easier, which is nice. Ooh, some spiders. Uh, that way not to be as lonely. I'm gonna drop a Bob's head here. Ooh, for a couple of my bomb back and two pennies. Yeah, that was probably... Oh, I got a Shadow Heart. If it wasn't for the Shadow Heart, that would have been worthless, but... It was worth it with that situation. Alright. So you're, uh, you know, just simple, easy rooms. You know, you gotta get those easy rooms. That way, you feel overpowered. And then they're gonna just destroy you later. But only going to Mom, I'm not too worried. I don't need to be too powerful to get to and beat Mom. Like, it's... I think Mom's actually one of the harder bosses, which is maybe sad to say, because I know she's known for being pretty easy. Um, I think Mom's heart is way easier... I think uh, Isaac is arguably easier. I, I, I don't know. I just Mom, there's so much stuff going on, and I'm just not good. Uh, this is probably not a good thing to get. A lot of people don't like Tiny Planet. I personally love it, and I've never done good with it. I just think it's too cool to pass up. And, you know, that's a fact. I just think it's too cool. And it's got, it, it can be very, very good. Uh, I hear it's garbage with Mom's knife. Which, uh, I find it hard to believe, but everyone that I've been hearing about say that it's terrible with Mom's knife. There are some, like, uh, what is it, the p p p the soy milk? It's still not, it's not good with soy milk, but it's way cool with soy milk. Ooh, uh, Vision. I'm gonna use it. It's basically like the world card, I believe. It, which is, uh, I, it might be a little, oh, it gives me a second secret room, though, also, so it's slightly better than the world card, apparently. Unless it, the, the world cards does something else I don't know about. Which is possible. I don't know what, exactly what anything does in this game. Besides, like, the poop, which just drops poop. I would like to get a key and visit the shop. I'm only one coin away. And I do have, you know, the donation machine, which I wouldn't... I almost never blow it up for money. But if it was, like, something cool like Hive Mind, and, uh, it would be awesome. Hive Mind is... I don't even think that good of an item. I just love it. Because it, it gives you, um... All your attack flies are bigger, and then every time you clear a room, you get, like, two flies or two spiders. So it's not like... It's like Guppy's head, but better. I think. But I, if I'm wrong, you know, you can call me out on it. I'll probably politely disagree. But, uh... I, you know, I at least like knowing that I'm wrong. To the public opinion. These guys are super easy. Crazy, crazy easy. They always get a hit on me, though. Well, that's just like most of the enemies in the game, I believe. Ooh, tons of red hearts. I kind of want to go check down there now. I wasn't going to. But if there's a chance that there's an arcade and a blood donation machine, then I've got to bite the bullet and uh, walk down there. And I, I don't think I'm utilizing my Trail of Tears very well. Or, like, at all for that matter. I, I got three bombs. I'll look for this. Um, I should be, though. I, I think uh, having your own creep is really good. Oh, wow, tons of money. Tons of uh, damage. I do. The reason I like Orbital Tears is well, one, it's probably one of the worst things I could take if I want to try to do a fast run. That's for sure. But I just feel like you get a you get to stay safe 
and then hit enemies. Like, if you just keep running away, and they will get hit. Um, I don't know why, but I feel like those that white pill is usually bad. I'm sure it's 100% random with no consistency when I say that whatsoever. But that's just my personal feelings. I don't know why I, I don't mean to keep the map that big. I don't. It actually probably just stops me from seeing tinted rocks. Which would be very useful. I mean, I've already taken red heart damage. But I would like to not take red heart damage on this boss. Maybe get a pentagram or uh, the pact would be even cooler. But besides that, there's not a ton. Of, uh, you know what? I'm gonna. There's so many extra hearts in here. Why not? I'll use one of them for a half heart. Uh, Chub. Probably a not a terrible situation, honestly. Except when I knock my bombs away from him because I'm an idiot. I like I like fighting Chub. Uh, I don't know what this Chub does. I think he might just dash at you, but with, especially with like the creep. I mean, he's nothing. Placenta is great. Um, it's actually pretty good with me as well, because I, I plan on taking damage to fuel my to fuel my rage or whatever. But hopefully, you know, I still don't want to take red heart damage. But that's going. I'm looking for a blood bank. Hopefully, get an IV bag and uh, set me up for some crazy high damage. But the you know the regeneration on placenta is pretty great. I, I can essentially just sit here and heal. I don't need to fire anything. I will eventually get to full health, but it could take a long ass time. But it will eventually heal me to full, guaranteed. But since I'm doing a stream and I'm not doing my own solo stuff, I'm not gonna bother with it. I I doubt I'll need full health that bad. I'd rather just lose and wait 20 minutes, or you know potentially longer depending on a uh, depending on that because it's like a percent chance. I believe it's like every minute or something you have a chance for it to do something. Eh, it gives me a free pill. I don't believe it does any damage either, so oh, I'm gonna check out the shop. Basically identical items. Like, I am gonna pick up the Shadow Heart, which I should have picked one up on the last shop now that I think about it. But I do not want a portable slot machine. I hate portable slot because I hate the normal slot machine. But if I was, um, if I was Kane, I'd probably at least give it an opportunity. You know, until I get full of uh, all the stuff I need. Alright, let's see here. Uh, am I making decent time? I'm making terrible time. Um, luck down. I'm just going to go straight for the boss, which is dirty. I should have gone for my item first, I'm aware. Uh, this is one of the probably harder fights I could have had for me because I'm terrible and Gertie has a ton of health. And it's really hard for me to uh, take care of those side things. Efficiently, especially with Gertie taking most of the bullets. I could have, I should have at least gone to, I got a bomb. Whatever, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to die here. If I do die, uh, I guess that'll be the video, and I'll set up, do a second one. Like, uh, it, you could just, I, I mostly do these so you can see what it's like for someone that's truly an idiot to play these games. Uh, which is, you know, me. I'm the idiot. I don't, you know, I don't want you to think I don't have any self-confidence. I like myself a lot. But, uh, I can acknowledge the fact that I'm, uh, I make bad decisions, and I'm not that good at games. But if heart Isaac is, like, hard, it's not even the hardest range up. You know, if I get, um... What is it? Not a, not a Spectral Tears, which, I mean, it would be cool. But if I get, um... Actually, I don't know if I need them with this. No, I don't think I need it with this. But if I... The one... The Piercing Tears. That's great. This... These tears become so much better with Piercing Tears. Because they just keep going and going. I mean, not indefinitely, but this you know that they are substantially better with piercing tears or like even the sad onion which I actually I really like the sad onion it does not give you a damage upgrade and it severely lowers your uh, uh, your sh your uh, range I, I, maybe your shot speed or at least your tier movement definitely tears up that's nice but I just it gives you tears that go through literally everything you know they're ethereal if that is the correct way to say it if it's not go screw yourself and uh, they also give you another heart, more HP upgrades. I mean, I guess it's nice. But I'm just gonna, eh, I'm gonna check the last room. I don't think I'm gonna make it to mom, beat mom in time. I'm really gonna have to pick up the pace here. Um, but they just go, they go through everything, which is nice. And they're huge. So I, if you get them really early on, it's great. And then you can just buff them from there. If you get it kind of late and it nerfs you down super hard, then it's not worth it. I don't think, but uh, like a first item room or first like boss, I don't know if you can get it from a boss, but I think they're great in that situation. I'm doing quite a bit of damage. I mean, that's because I've taken a lot of damage. Oh, she is. There we go. 
lovers. You know, that's actually good to have because I'm not keeping any spirit hearts because that's my new, uh, that's the new meta. Uh, you do full red heart runs. Spirit hearts are for uh, noobs that played vanilla. This is called Rebirth, baby. All right, I'm going to take uh, damage here to uh, get a soul heart, which actually will help me out. Uh, about that red heart stuff, yeah, that was bullshit. You need soul hearts or everything. Like, that's come as, like, I like, I like playing as Blue Baby. I like playing as Azazel. I like not having any red hearts. Like, I lose a lot more, but I have an enjoyable experience. Not having to worry about red hearts. Uh, blue, not as much Blue Baby. It's because you don't get any red hearts. I like having, like, one spare red heart in the bank. That way I could, you know, I don't know. It just, it makes me feel more confident. I'm, I, I never check what floor I'm on. I'm pretty sure I have to get through this boss here and then get to the next floor to get the bomb. I'm hoping to get an Emperor card uh, soon. I'm just going to go... Yeah, I'm going to try to bum rush these rooms as fast as I can. This is the probably the worst item I can do to get it. Worst case scenario, I don't get to it. I'm just going to see how far I can get. And uh, since I'll be taking probably a hit from exploring, not exploring the floors, I'll probably won't make it very far. Oh my god, I hate when they do that. Uh, of course, I mean, who would like an enemy having a second stage, I suppose. Uh, this Gish is pretty good. Little Gish. He, uh, you know, he slows enemies. But since I'm not doing a lot of aiming, he, I guess he gives me some, like, straight shots again, which is nice. But I normally aim away with Little Planet. I find it more efficient. Is it any more efficient? I don't know. I just feel like once they get closer, because the tiers clearly go right to that... They, they cross right at a specific spot behind you, so... If it's going to be close, there's a... If they're far away, I feel it's good to aim at them. But if they're close, then it's... I'm just... Yeah, I'm not going to screw around. I'm just going to go. Uh, then aiming away from them, I think, is faster. Uh, again, it's probably bullshit. I'm probably an idiot. And I'm... I mean, come on. I just took two damage against damn spiders in a... Just because it's a little dark? Yeah, I know I can't see that well. So what? Uh, it's actually all part of my plan to, uh... Get uh, uh, to get my damage up. That way, I can just plow through the boss. I'm gonna use my bomb here. All right, I got a black heart. I'm gonna leave, come back in, use the lovers because I don't care what this card is. I'm taking it. Uh, stars is the item room, I believe. I could be wrong. Uh, Guppy, no, I'm gonna die if I take Guppy. Don't get me wrong. I really want Dead Cat. I think it's a great item. But it's another reason why I don't like keeping any uh, spirit hearts. Or I don't like keeping any red hearts, because then Guppy, or Dead Cat, becomes a health upgrade if you don't have any. Or if you have like a half heart, it just heals you. Those are situations that are awesome to be in, where Dead Cat doesn't have any negative side effects. But we're not always that lucky. I don't remember what all the items do. Let's see. I got four minutes. Okay, I got. I really, really want to make it. I'm, I don't think there's any chance of me making it because I don't know how uh, I don't know how to do it. I'm super slow and terrible. I'm gonna get full HP here, which is kind of nice. Uh, Bloody Penny, which is actually awesome. All right, let's go. Boss room's got to be close. It's got to be close. Yeah, hit me. I don't care. See if I give a shit. I do, but you know, not not a big one. Let's see, yeah, we got them. Yeah, these are the tiers that are probably the worst to use in a trying to get a boss rush mode because I can't, like, I can safely kill them, but I can't safely kill them fast. Yeah, we're gonna go for it. I'm gonna go to the next floor, use stars. Hopefully, it gets me closer to the boss room. I guess I might want that key. Actually, it probably doesn't matter. Loki's not a big deal, I don't think. Not when I've taken all this damage. Still kind of hard to hit consistently, but you know, whatever. I think I'll be fine. I'm gonna have a. I'm gonna have. I would like to leave my another range upgrade. Oh man. I mean, Tiny Planet already gives me so much. So I got two and a half minutes to get there. Beat Mom. Uh, hopefully. Hopefully I got it. Let's do the stars right now. Mom's wig, which I really like. Like a lot. You know, just spiders. When I get hit, when I hit enemies, or when I get hit, or just randomly, like every minute or something, it gets spawned up to like three spiders a room or something. It, I don't like I don't remember all the exact item details. I just know it gives me spiders. All right, come on, die, 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 die. 
I don't know how much HP I have, which is not the best situation to be in. But it's not the worst. Actually, I wanna, should purposely take a hit here, get my damage up, take this, leave. This was not the right direction to go, and I'm disappointed in myself. Should have bought the compass, should have bought the map and compass, should have bought the map, compass, and blue map. Um, change. That is the D6 in uh, f that form. Oh man, I gotta go get that after I get that. Uh, that is the D6, and uh, but a rune, I do believe. I have completed all the challenges on this also. Mostly because the challenges are all easy, besides the, like, the purest. They're not like all easy, but none of them are like that, you know. None of them are that crazy hard. Yeah, come on, you piece of crap. Alright, let's go for Mom. I have no, no idea how much HP I have. I think these tiers might actually be good against Mom. No idea. That could be complete bullcrap. Let's go. Red Mom? Uh, not too bad. Oh, wait, it's regular Mom. Looked like Red Mom for a second. Alright, I think uh, we got a full minute to defeat her. I think we're safe. Uh, it's obviously not set in stone. But uh, I think she'll be dead in the next 30 seconds here. Especially since I get to hit all of her rooms with these tiers, because they are of such long range. Perfect. Alright, uh, I'm going to take the Polaroid. I like it more. I'm going to go down to boss rush mode. Uh, pu -pu -pu -pu. I don't know what this does with this. I'm going to do it. Polyphemus. Okay, so they're really slow. But hopefully they're really large and in charge. I still don't know how much... Oh, crap. <laughs> I have no idea how much health I have. I do have to beat this mode to make it count. Shadowheart, I, since I have no idea how much I have, I'm going to take it. Alright, that's gone. Uh, that poop's going to be the thing that kills me. I can already feel it. Man, these tiers are buff as shit, though. I actually like this uh, mode more when uh, Karen Queen or whatever goes into that zone. Nice. Uh, all those tiers upgrades are really coming in handy right now because these are not that slow. Christ. Christ almighty. Alright, yeah. So far, I, I'm, thinking, I'm feeling pretty good about this. I don't know where my HP's at, but this room drops so many hearts, it should be fine. There's usually no danger of dying in this room. I just don't know how much I lost on Mom. Well, I have a... Hopefully I'll be able to reach the H my you know full HP again, that way I know I'll be safe. Because I could still just be three hits from dead or four hits from dead. But still, taking four hits without getting any hearts I think would be kind of difficult. Especially with these gigantic tears floating around me. It doesn't feel like they're all gigantic. Some of them are just randomly small. I should be going for these. I mean, time doesn't really matter anymore. I can calm down, take a breath. I do, and I will get an item for uh, completing this, and I do have the plethro, or per, per throw. So that could be a... If it's a terrible item, I can reroll it into a... Probably another terrible item with my luck, but... A terrible item that I can't be upset about, because I'm like, well, I got it now. Ooh, did I just... Oh, it's that... Gosh darn poop. I knew... I know it's going to be the death of me. I know it. Okay, I, I have full red hearts, which I do not, which is bull, bull crap. Gertie just went down like a... He took it to the chin. I don't know what that means exactly. I'm guessing it's a... Uh, I'm guessing it's a reference to uh, eating too much candy, and then it causes you to pass out from that sugar coma. That's my... That's my... Uh, that's my assumption here. God, if they just stop jumping... You don't have to, but you're getting me... Dealing me... Like, these are easy enemies, too, but... I'm not good at, I, I think they're really hard when you can't see the entire map. Oh man, that thing just fell down like nothing. I think they're hard when you can't see the entire map just because they summon the things. It, it, it's an excuse. They're always easy. I'm just... My brain just doesn't work right all the time. Alright, yeah, nothing. Nothing easy peasy. Uh, Mask of Infamy might be a pain in the butt. Depends how much uh, this heart can take. Nothing. Alright, yeah, so Massive Infamy might be no big deal at all. Oh my gosh, I don't know. I, it, do, it is very upsetting not knowing how much HP I have. How, where does their HP have? There's no way I'm not, like, killed either of them. And there is a way, obviously, because I haven't. 
I am going for Famine first just because he's the easy target. Uh, this guy is also not too bad as long as you can... Oh gosh, I did not see that at all. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. There's no hearts dropping. I'm close to the end, but I don't think that's going to matter. Come on, is there any... Oh, there's a half red heart. Alright, so I got at least one more hit in me. And I've got at least two hits in me now. Alright, this is the last, uh... I believe this is the last. Hopefully they don't fire too much, too many brimstones. Which they just did. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Nope, oh, I got it. Samson's Chain. Nice. I thought I had already had the lock. Little Chubby? Love Little Chubby. Let's re-roll it to Deck of Cards, of course. Deck of Cards is great. Who doesn't love Deck of Cards? I mean, I like Deck of Cards. The Sun? Yeah. That turned out to be much better than I thought. If it would have given me any other card besides the Sun or Herophon, I would have been like, eh. But no, that worked out pretty good, and I'm pretty sure I just passed up a Tinted Rock, but I had believe I had no bombs. I did not, so it all, you know what? It all doesn't matter. Uh, this room hopefully is not too bad. Ah, yeah, caramba. Do these tiers just get randomly small? Do these tiers get smaller as they go out? Maybe I didn't pick up the one big tier thing. Maybe I picked up a something different. I don't know. Maybe I don't know what I got. You don't know what it got. You got till it's gone. That's true. Breaking my back just to know your name. Uh, Fort 17 tracks. I had it with this game. I'm gonna see if this guy drops a health upgrade. Hopefully, I didn't kill him. No, okay, good. I've got enough money. You know, just rolling in dubs, iced out like hockey. Got kicked out of Japan for drinking all the sake. And that—that's a true story. Oh no, he's gonna kill himself. You suck a fatty McFatty McHeimer. You know what? I'm sure he. He didn't mean to kill himself. Who would want to kill themselves? I shouldn't treat him like that. But he's right next to the Demon Judgment. I wonder if that, I wonder if you die next to a Demon Judgment if that means you go to hell. I would assume so. Don't know. Uh, demon Judgment. I, I'm just gonna blow him up because he's. I don't like looking at his face. It's a waste because he's gonna give me two. Uh, you know, two. Oh no, he gives me red hearts. But you know, a few coins and a key. It's nothing. No biggie, whoop, 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 whoop. Uh, I do like the red ones, because they do way more damage. I think they do a full heart of damage regardless, and so it doesn't matter on the wound, but they have definitely have more projectiles. But you can hit them while they're defending. They, you know, they're not immune to damage ever. I always think that these guys can't shoot through rocks, but they totally can. Alright, nothing, nothing, you're nothing. I don't know why you spawned on top of me, it's kind of rude. I'm pretty sure it's like against the rules. I feel like some of my tears are coming out really small. Maybe they just get smaller as they reach the edge. I don't know. Then I have lump. Well, for some reason, I get my runs mixed up, so I was like, I definitely have lump of coal, but I have not fought Krampus, so there's no way. In fact, I don't really think I've been to a deal with the devil. I'm going to inefficiently use this full heart to recover a half heart. Joker, using it. Bum friend, this run might turn out okay. Bum friend is, uh,. A f he's got a friend in me. You know, some folks may be bigger and stronger than I am. I don't know. Okay, I don't know all the lyrics. You know, I'm trying to quote that song. Quit, quit making fun of me. When I got some, especially with uh, all the money drops giving me uh, red hearts, it's gonna be nice. You know, half hearts. I'm not gonna go back for that. If I end up losing by one heart, which is not gonna happen, but if I do, you know what? I'll take full blame for that. The Bloat is one of my least favorite enemies in the game, uh, hands down. You're supposed to stay above him. But when I can't fly, and I can't... He's just hes just a pain in the my fat dick. And I'm sorry, my dick's not actually fat. I just, like, uh, I'm really self-conscious, and I try to feel better about myself. HP and luck up. That luck up works really well going to the mom's heart. Uh, that way when I fight Mom's Heart, it actually has a chance to just commit suicide if your luck is high enough, which is uh, untrue, but, you know, maybe in the next uh, expansion that should be coming out. Ah, oh, man. All right, money. Uh, it's going to give me lots of red hearts. I'm going to take some of those for myself as well. Oh, give me a black heart. You're too kind. You God, Come on, let me, at least let me get back up to full hearts, you son of a bitch. I'm sorry, I'm not mad at you, bum friend. 
but I mean, I would have had a... Right now, the hearts are more efficient. If you have any missing HP, they're more efficient to go to you, because you're guaranteed to get that much, you know, health back. He only gives you a, you know, every one and a half hearts he pays out. I could probably reach the HP cap because of this arcade. I did get Lucky Scab, so I'm hoping that uh, makes the payout a little bit higher. Well, it definitely makes it a little bit higher, because that's exactly what Luck does. Uh, I'm going to go down to 15, even though I don't need 15 for anything. I just like... Like, in case I run into a donation machine, I want to be able to... I want to be able to do something. I think that's fine. Yeah, that's probably fine. This sun card might... Uh, not win the game for me, but it might ex do exactly that. It might win the game for me. Yeah, you son of a bitch. What are you doing? Get the hell out of my town. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. Alright, I'm feeling pretty good about this run now. Uh, there was a few times I was not feeling too good about this run, but now I'm feeling good about this run. Oh my god, this room is hell. What do they want from me? What do they want from me? Alright, but all seriousness, uh, this is probably the most ideal room I could imagine getting on the womb. Uh, that room is also pretty uh, nifty, if you ask me. I feel like most of the rooms are difficult not because of the enemies in them, but because of the layout of the room. Which actually is one reason I really like the game, is that just like switching the way enemies appear in the room can make the game so much harder. I do like the Empress. It uh, gives me four Babylon for a room. Uh, I could take it with me and then come back for the sun because I'm not going to use the sun against Mom. But that just makes sounds like such a hassle, doesn't it? I don't believe I've really gotten that many damage upgrades. All right, there you go, bum friend. Uh, I don't think he's going to pay out. I'm going to I'm going to go in see if I get a damage upgrade like the Penta shit, whatever it's called. Hey, that's a, that's you know. Infamy? You know what? I really like Infamy. It helps people like me, who take some dumb damage while you're staring it in the face, and it's like, hey, it's not all bad. I know you took dumb damage, he's gonna pay out here. I'm like 99.9% 9 .9 sure. But, uh, you know what? Every now and then, it just, you don't have to worry about it. It's kind of like having free soul hearts. It, it just kind of helps increase your HP cap, which it doesn't like actually do that, obviously. But that's kind of what it does, where... Every now and then it just hit, it just won't do anything. It's like, yeah, no, that hit didn't happen. So instead of losing any hearts, you just kind of gotta, you know, you got extra, you got your heart still. You know, it's sad, it's hard, it's sad as hard as to say, but now that I've got Dark Foam, I actually am kind of little too okay with probably taking some damage. Because I do like the damage up. And that's one good thing about Samson, is even with no damage ups, you can still end up doing freaking tons of damage. Tons of damage. If you, um, do it right... Oh man, I almost knocked that bomb out of the way. Or if you just, like, take hits. If you, like, you should just build defensively, obviously. Like, I don't need to tell you that. I don't want to break that poop. I'm going to. You better believe it. Because I, I'm going to hit myself on these flies. You know what? I don't even care. I don't like the way it looks. It looks at me like my father used to. Oh man, dark past. You know what? Hey, I got through it without breaking it. Nice. Alright, uh, Gertie, Gertie Jr., Gertie Lings, and, uh, the Gertie Ling Jr. Lings. I don't know exactly what all their names are, I'm sorry. Uh, please don't, uh, castrate me for that. I don't know why, I'm, I, I just know those funny rocks sometimes drop that kind of shit right there. And then Bum Friend sometimes pays out with that kind of shit right there. Emperor? Um, well, I mean, I, I'm right next to it, I could just use it. I'm not going to. That'd be stupid. You know what, I think, should I go get the Horror Babylon? How far is it? Yeah, it's not that far. I'll go get the, I'll go get the Horror Babylon. Because I'm like 99% sure that I can leave this room, like, I can leave the Mom's heart room. I'm like, Mom, I think Mom's the only room you can't leave when you fight. Which is, you know, it's actually quite annoying. Man, God, look how big that is. Holy shit. Um, did I have two soul hearts in that curse room? It would take two hearts to get to it, so it doesn't matter. There's no way I can get out of there without breaking even. So it would just be wasting time. I believe there's actually three in there, but since I have, you know, 
I'm missing two hearts. I collect. I take one going in. I collect two, and I take one going out. And I so I, I'll lose two for two. I'm gonna go in here. Uh, use the card. Wow, that was some fast crap. Don't. Yeah, that's right. That went better than I think I could have imagined. I'm pretty sure the the devil room doesn't do anything because I always think the devil room is like mom's devil room where you can actually uh, get it. Emperor, the sun. I think the sun is too good. The emperor would obviously get me directly to directly to Isaac, but the sun is just a full health pill. I mean, it's not. A, I mean, that's how you use it. That's how I'm going to use it anyway. You know, I don't. I'm not going to use it for the map or the damage. Those are two very negative, like, not negative effects, but not nearly as good as just being at full HP. I can't see what my HP is at, but since I cannot pick up their red heart, and I'm, I was two black hearts away from being at the cap, so... I, I didn't take a hit, so I'm 90% sure that's where I'm still at. Unless something happened that I wasn't paying attention. Alright, so hopefully I can find Isaac fast here. I usually, I feel like once you beat Isaac, you can just beat Blue Baby, which is why I almost always take the Polaroid. Not because Blue Baby is, like, easy, but just because those four chests really do make a big difference. They, they can make no difference, but I feel like, in general, they just they help a lot. I feel like I'm going to take damage here because this spider always knows where you're at. He just always drops down somewhere where he's going to hit you. That's not true. He doesn't always, but I just feel like that's what he does. Or maybe, you know, maybe it is. I don't know. I'm, I didn't design this character. I, uh, and I was, uh... The Whipworm I actually really like, but I don't think it's practical to take the whip for him when I've got Dark Bum and Blood Penny. I mean, come on, that's a synergy that you can't pass up. Die! I feel like if I say things more dramatically that they work out better, and they do. Almost always. Almost always. Is that a phrase you can use? It's like, oh yeah, almost, but then always. It's either always or it's not always. Almost always doesn't make any sense. But yet, I can't think of another way to describe it as almost always. It's like saying, like, always, sometimes. Alright, let's see. Uh, judgment? I'm gonna use Judgment. It's a... Ooh, it's the best kind of Judgment I could have imagined. The one I'm not gonna use. I mean, I bet I, I could probably honestly safely do it. Back then, no, you don't know. Hell no. I'd take taking full heart each time. I would just go crazy. I would like to take that. Did I take it? Uh, I don't know. See, this doesn't make the sun card useless. But it does diminish the efficient, you know, the effectiveness of it. Because I don't know when I need to use it. Why did I take a hit there? You know what? Sometimes I like living on the edge. Oh, double Loki? He, it's actually a... Uh, I haven't had an issue with Loki before. I don't know if it's because I'm always doing well when I get to Loki. But I think Loki might just be really easy. Like, it summons a bomb fly, but I mean, one bomb fly at a time. The only time bomb flies ever really irritate me is when there's like seven of them, and you can't move anywhere because they give you one pillar to walk up and down. Oh, then I'm like, well, what the hell do you want from me, game? What the hell do you want from me? Of course I'm going to take a hit. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes I can fly. In which case, you know, whatever. Go me. I think I have to shoot towards Isaac for that chance to slow. Alright, well, I haven't gone to my red hearts yet, which is nice. I am doing, like, I don't want to say butt-ton because I don't know if that's a good thing. But I would describe it as a butt-ton of damage. This is my least favorite stage. I think it is definitely the hardest of the stages. Even though I generally take more hits in this stage, at least I just feel like he's easier to get damage on. Uh, I won't lie, this, this stage does scare me. But I do think it's the easiest of the stages. Usually I can get through this... I mean, not usually. I have safely gotten through this stage without taking hits more than any of the other stages. But sometimes I just take a, sta a hit every single time he does that pillar thing. Because I'm an idiot. Alright, so I'm, I am on my red hearts. Which is a bit scary, but hopefully these chests really uh, carry me through the blue baby fight. Alright, so I, uh, I got no black hearts, which I already knew. Halo? Uh, yeah. Uh, little Steven? I mean, I'm not going to not take it. Uh, Mulligan? Yeah. And uh, Halo of Flies. 
Those are all good. I wouldn't say any of them are great. Hey, I mean Halo. I mean Halo is great. Mulligan is good. I would have preferred any kind of. I would have preferred piercing tears. It would have really, I think, helped me out a crazy amount. I do like trying to bait them into doing their side attack, obviously, which is not like some pro level shit. It's just like, hey, you want to make them not powerful? You want to make them do, you know, just force there to force them to sit there and take your attacks? Like, yeah, I think I would like to do that. Oh no. When they're not together though, they scare me. Just like my parents. Oh, zing. The lovers? Yeah, I want to take that, but I want to take them for myself, you piece of crap. I do like Dark Bum, don't get me wrong, but why would I give him a, you know, potentially a payout of one when I guarantee you get myself a payout of two? Man, yeah, come on, come on. Those things are just dropping me. Those are some of my least favorite enemies to fight, not the mega super greed shit thing, but those little things. Because if you don't have much damage on a run, they just deal damage and damage and... Ugh. Oh, I didn't kill him yet. I'm sorry. And it just... They can just be so irritating. Then they take your money. It just makes you want to commit suicide in the bathroom. And you know what? I've been there. I've done, you know, I've done that, obviously. I'm making this video. But I've considered it, man. Every time bathroom suicide doesn't seem that bad. Nothing. Halo flies is protecting me. I'm sure Mulligan is doing something. I you know it's probably doing what it does. Uh, Mega Man, Ma, Ma, Mega Man is a uh, even double of them. I don't really care about it too much. That guy that fires bombs irritates the shit out of me. But I don't believe this one fires bombs. I believe this is the version that doesn't do that. And I'm decided I want to take as many hits as possible to build uh, up my damage and the suspense of this run. Trying to keep you guys guessing. You know, I don't really know what it is. I don't. I don't normally beat Blue Baby on a run. In fact, I would say I lose a hell of a lot more runs than I win. But this game is. It's deciding that it wants to make me a liar. Liar. When I say that I'm, you know, losing at a game. Maybe I'll just have to play something like Dark Souls and prove that I'm terrible at games. I mean, I can almost get through that first boss, which is a joke. No, I can't. I'll get there someday. I love you, I'll follow you, you are my, my life. I'll read my Bible and pray, and I will follow you all day. Sometimes random church songs stick in my head. Don't know why, haven't gone to church, and I can't remember how long. If you go to church, nothing against it. I'm totally, I'm, everyone believe what they want to believe. I'm cool with that. And I actually, I, even though I'm not personally that very religious, I really enjoyed church. So I don't like it when people knock against it. But I don't, you know, I don't know we should talk about religion on this video. I mean gonna spark some crazy comment things which would mean I get more views and potentially money so yes religion religion politics Obamacare take my guns you can't take my guns Obama unless everyone on the internet wants you to take our guns in which case you can take my guns Obama you can't not take my guns Obama thanks Obama also religion and Mormon actually speaking of religions uh, in, a, in a I was just watching the Book of Mormon uh, by the South Park guys and that is a uh, I didn't watch the play itself, but I was, I, the soundtrack was for free for Amazon Prime members. And I think that it is super awesome. I actually, oh man, I actually got a comment. Someone just commented something. That sounds super duper. But the Book of Mormon, uh, if you're not easily offended, I highly recommend it. I'm not going to read that comment right now because I have to turn down for what? Haha, <laughs> I do have to, um, uh, I have to take more damage against bloat than I'm supposed to to do that. I, I got a sun card. I, I don't see Blue Baby beat me uh, because I'm going to have my eye closed the whole fight. Aha, zing. But seriously, I um, I feel like this run is sorted now, which I should have felt like. Oh, temperance. Yes. Yes. I, well, the thing is, I could probably blow it up for money and hearts. So I am going to drop that baby down. I got a bomb, actually. It wanted me to blow it up. It's a sign. All right, I got money, which will give me hearts. Uh, in theory. In theory, it did give me hearts. It didn't, but in theory, it did. Alright, these guys got no health whatsoever. It's almost embarrassing. Uh, they remind me, they, to me, they look like my grandpa, but I don't know what my grandpa looks like, so I don't exactly know what that means. Right, here we go. I'm pretty sure I already had this room, but, you know, it's not uncommon to get multiple of the same room. <laughs> baby, baby boomer. There we go. I don't know what that meant. Super easy. I want to keep my half heart uh, interval for the Polaroid invincibility. Well, that's that's, not, that's pretty nice. 
All right, uh, Blue Baby is a pain in the pain in the butt, but this damage is so crazy. I just got—I think I got the Polyphemia Morpheus, uh, the the Morpheus pill, uh, the blue one, the so uh, you know rabbit holes or something. I don't exactly know what it does. I'm gonna drop a bomb and I'm gonna shoot this direction. Oh man, they should call him Blue Bitch. Oh man, that's not nice. He actually tries very hard. I'm I'm assuming to be all scary. I mean, he's all dead in his chest and whatever. All right, well, there we go. I won again. <laughs> I swear, I know I got down to, like, a lose streak of, like, a win streak of, like, minus 23. So, it's kind of weird to have a streak where I'm not losing. But who knows? Maybe this, uh, you, maybe me talking the whole time is what gets me winning. And I'll have to rename the series to Let's Win At. But I don't feel like that would get as many views. When I say as many views, I mean, I think I'd go from five uh, views a video to maybe like three views a video, and that'd be devastating. Percentage-wise, that's a pretty substantial amount. All right, well, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I might upload another one tonight, even. I'm not sure yet. Uh, I'll just have to see how it goes and how this sounds. I might just wait till tomorrow when I have a better mic, and then I have more time to dedicate to doing this. All right, well, love you guys very much. Thank you very much for watching. And, uh, well, you know, peace out. I'm actually going to read this comment really quick first. How do you get the chest room like this? Uh, how do I get to the chest room like this, I'm guessing? Um, I get to the, I got the chest room mostly by, uh, being an idiot and getting really lucky. I got most no damage upgrades, and I got, I took a ton of hits where I shouldn't have. But I got really lucky with Spirit Hearts, a lot of HP upgrades, and being uh, oh, Samson, every time I took a hit, I did tons of damage. So it just, it, the damage just got crazy. And then once I got, uh, I went to the boss rush room and got the Polymorpheus, Polymephus, the big Cyclops eye, I believe. And that, um, that just put the damage through the roof, like, unbelievably. Especially because I got at least... I think three, maybe four range upgrades. So the damage, the tiers have stayed max damage for so long. And uh, the, then the chest, I got more good items. It was just, I got a bunch of good things. I, being a Samson helped a lot with that Bloody Lust. And, um, but then once I got Dark Bum and Bloody Penny come together, then it just, it's settled. Because every time I pick up a penny, I get a half heart. Every three pennies gives me a soul heart on top of normal soul heart drops and red heart drops. It was... It would have been hard to lose in that situation, I felt. I thought I could still manage to pull off the lose, but uh, I didn't. All right, uh, well, well, thank you very much for the comment. Uh, I appreciate it very much. Uh, I love you guys, and uh, this is actually the end now. So uh, if you like it, uh, if you like this video, a like on the video would be awesome. Maybe a subscribe, you know, whatever. I'm not going to shove it down your throat, but uh, I'm going to make these videos regardless if you like it or not. So showing your support does make me feel good, though. All right, peace out, everybody.